no protein powder, no high sugar, and no high salt intake. If you want to stay fit, then you must avoid all this. No wait, I am not an expert on this, but Indian Council of Medical Research has issued the new dietary guidelines for Indians. But before that, please make sure you like the video and subscribe to the Money Control. The Indian Council of Medical Research has urged to avoid protein supplements for building body mass and has recommended restricting salt intake, minimizing sugar and ultra processed food and suggested reading information on food labels to make informed and healthy food choices. On 8th of May, ICMR has issued these dietary guidelines for Indians. These guidelines aim to fulfill essential nutrient needs and prevent non-communicable diseases. Unhealthy dietary habits contribute to approximately 56.4% of India's total disease burden. The National Institute of Nutrition, part of the top health research organization, updated these guidelines after 13 years. They highlight that healthy eating and exercise can lower the risk of heart disease, high blood pressure and even prevent most cases of type 2 diabetes. The 148-page report has 17 guidelines advising less use of cooking oil. Instead, it suggests getting healthy fats from nuts, seeds and seafood. The report also warns against eating too many processed food high in sugars and fats. Among its guidelines, the body suggests cutting down on salt, using oil and fats moderately, exercising regularly, and reducing sugar in processed foods. It also advises Indians to limit sugar intake to 20 to 25 grams per day, mainly from natural sources like carbohydrates. The National Institute of Nutrition also advised against protein supplements for building muscle mass. They warned that using too much of protein powder can harm kidneys and bones. Having protein intake levels above 1.6 gram per kg body weight per day won't lead to more muscle gain from resistant exercise. They also recommended keeping sugar intake under 5% of total energy and getting no more than 45% of calories from grains and millets and up to 15% from pulses, beans and meat. The rest of your calories should come from nuts, vegetables, fruits and milk. They advise keeping total fat intake at or below 30% of your energy.